Oh yeah. Uh, uh, feels good. Feels good. Chop, chop. Hey, yo, what's up? It's your girl, Songbird. Hey, it's Dante Black. And we're back for another episode of your favorite internet show, Polar Opposites, the Melanin Edition, the international version, y'all. Yes. Bahama, y'all? The Bahamas version. Let me not call it international. The Bahamas version. All right, so if this is your first time tuning in, what's up? Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and that notification bell that is down below so that you're notified every time a new episode of Polar Opposites pops up and for our returning opposite fam what they do all right so let's get into today's topic taking kids on vacation now as i said we're out on the cruise and i mean it's all adult fun and you see these little kids just running through they out here twerking and having fun playing all this type of music and then you you you're twerking and stuff and then all of a sudden you're running to a baby uh-uh I'm over here trying to relax and have fun. I'm on vacation. And then I got this kid over here that I'm about to twerk on. Uh-uh. Then on top of that, I'm going to the club all having fun. But I can't dance with nobody because I don't know how old they are. I'm like, I'm not going to try and go to jail for grinding up on a minor. No, nah, that ain't it. That ain't what we doing. Yeah. So that's why you just stay on the wall to yourself and keep that urge to, to grind on the wall. I totally agree because, and, and the sad part about it is the ones that's out there doing the twerking is the parents of the children that's there. Children if, right there. If you, first off, okay, what I'm about to say may piss some of y'all off. So you now have the option to stop watching. If you consent, you consent to everything I'm about to say. Y'all niggas and y'all hoes, because that's all it is, it's just niggas and hoes. Y'all hoes that's bringing y'all kids on these cruises, if you plan on being a thought while you there, don't do that around your kid. Don't have them there. And most of the places have the little kids' areas where they can go and play, they can watch movies, they can color, they can play games, all of that. It's a part of the cruise package that you bought. Exactly, but in there. have them in there. Or matter yet, if you plan on being a hoe the entire time with your friends, don't bring them at no. all. Go pay for a babysitter, don't just call grandma. Pay for a babysitter that's gonna watch these kids till you come back. Yeah. The trip, you ain't gonna be going that long. You're gonna be going between two days to a week. You can find somebody. Pay the money to do that because you're gonna pay all this extra money to do everything else you wanna do on here anyway. Yeah. So just go ahead and put a little extra to the side to watch the kids. Right. Don't have your kids, and, and the, the messed up part about it is, I'm gonna just be real. It was a female there. She was twerking like she was a like, stripper. stripper twerking. You can see the coochie oh, print from the back. And her son looked like he was maybe eight or nine. And would look absolutely mortified. As a matter of fact, no, he looked like he was used to his mama doing mm -hmm. this. This is just what she does exactly. all the time. He's used to that. And ain't no eight or nine year old should see his mama coochie print from the back. And she wasn't just dancing just right there in the area. No, the whole deck of people, 200 plus people, is watching you do this. You and your friends. All y'all got on small oh, things, butt cheeks friends. hanging out. And y'all got kids there watching that. And it was little girls in that group. So what the fuck you think they going to do? Teaching them. They going to see my mommy doing this. And then they got, they got everybody here clapping for them. And yeah. random guys jumping behind them and slapping them on the butt and all this other stuff. Yeah. They got tons of this stuff going on. And these kids are sitting there absorbing this. So if y'all going to be hoes, don't carry your kids to stuff like that. And they just always say, we on vacation, we on vacation. But your child is right there. But your child is right there. Exactly. And you let everyone know that that's your child right there. Exactly. Because so, she brought the child in front of everybody and had them dance in an adult setting. These are all adults. And first off, I wouldn't bring a kid, I wouldn't bring kids on a cruise where there's going to be multiple adults because adults are going to do adult things. Exactly. They don't have on clothes that maybe kids shouldn't see. Hence bikinis, speedos, thongs, and you know, they're getting in and out the pool. They're getting in and out the beach water. Things like that. You really don't want your kids to see in yeah. its entirety. I mean, yeah, yeah, you may, yeah. yeah, you may see some things if you go to your local beach. But when you go out to a vacation, you need to keep you need to keep in mind that maybe you should take your kids to a place where there's going to be more kids mm -hmm. than adults. You know, Something Disney. Exactly. Um, I think they got a Nickelodeon one. I'm not real sure on that. And just anything that's protect that's geared towards that's kids. Kid friendly. Yeah. You want to go through that because these. Are 
because when you're going on these these big carnival cruises, Norwegian and all of them stuff, this is not for kids. It's not, especially when y'all have a twerking contest. At that yeah, point, that's, that's you should have said, you know what? Let I'm, me go take you to the room. Exactly. Let me go take you over here to the kids' home so you can go over here and play with the children. But you know what she did? She took them there after the whole dance contest was over. Then she took the kids in when they should have been in there the first to begin with. Exactly. Don't have your kids out there watching. So, and I know it's a lot of people that was out there because I seen a few females. They was out there. They was flirting with guys, and they had their little daughters there, their little sons there. I seen a guy. He came there with his kids. It's just him and his kids. He know every hoe that was there. Everyone that looked like they was DTF, he knew them, and he was waving to them. Now I don't know if he knew them prior to coming, but. I doubt it. Seeing as how during the twerk, everybody that was in that twerking contest, yeah, everybody was in that twerking contest, they were from different places. Mm -hmm. They weren't all from the same place. And he's buddy buddy with all of them now. So what message is that sending to your kids? Fathers, you got to protect the image of your kids yeah, as well mothers, as you mothers. You have to do a better job of protecting your kids and things. Exactly. All right, so what do you guys think about it? Do you think just because you're on vacation with your kids that it's okay that everybody lets loose or that you should kind of shield your kids from it? Make sure that you sound off below in the comments and make sure that you like it if you haven't subscribed. All right, Songbird, peace. Dr. Black.